Welcome to this Gantt Excel tutorial. In this video, I will show you how to add tasks in Gantt Excel. Tasks are the basic unit of action in Gantt Excel. You can create tasks, assign them to others or yourself, set costs and dates for tracking, and add notes for context. There are many ways you can add tasks. When you create a new Gantt chart in Gantt Excel, a default task is already added. So I'm going to modify this default task and type in the task name. Say, for example, architectural design. Now the first method is to click the task placeholder cell where it reads, type here to add a new task. Click on the add task button in the Gantt menu. Type in the task name. The start date is set to today by default. Click the OK button when done. The task is added to the Gantt chart with the default duration set to one day. The second method to add a task is to right click and select the Add Task option from the context menu. Type in the task name and also let's add a few task details. Let's set the estimated start date to tomorrow. The date picker automatically shows up. Select the date and click the Select button. I'm going to change the duration to three days and the estimated end date is calculated automatically. I'm also going to click the Copy from Estimated button to copy the same dates into the baseline dates as well. Let's set the estimated cost to $2,000 US dollars. Click on OK when done. The third method to add a task is to just double click the task placeholder cell where it reads, Type here to add a new task. The task form opens up. In this case, let me make this task dependent on the previous task. Do not worry about dependencies for now. I will cover task dependencies in a future video. Lastly, the fourth and easiest method to add a task is to type in the task placeholder cell, which reads, Type here to add a new task. I'm going to type, Decide date and venue to sign agreement, and hit the Enter key on the keyboard. This action will create a task and set the start and finish dates automatically. Let's explore how to create a milestone in the next video. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you have any questions or feature requests, please share them in the comments below. Kindly like and share this video. Also, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get new video updates. Thank you.